longtime rival Purdue University visits historic Williams Arena for big time Big Ten basketball. Make no mistake about it, yes, it's early, but this one's a big one, particularly for the Gophers trying to protect home court today. Austin Holland's ball fake. Snakes into the lane and a layup is good. No one stopped him. Austin Holland with five. Coach wanted to stop the dribble, stop the ball, uh, stop the bounce, and just really defend, to impose our will on them, um, try to pressure them, force them into turnovers, and just get out and run. Here's a steal by Matthew, and a breakaway layup is good. Matthew stepped into a passing lane, and it's 11 4. Andre Hollins gives to Eliason for the Gophers, off to Austin Hollins, open three from straight oh. on, and he curled it in. Gives to Austin Hollins, pivoting into a three, good! And the three by Austin Hollins gives him three triples today, he's three of four. Here's Austin Hollins, goes baseline, and a slam dunk. 18 for Austin, 49-39. We played about 33 minutes of phenomenal basketball. It's probably our best game of the year offensively as well as defensively. We shared the ball. Uh, we got stops on the defensive end. And in the last couple minutes, we just didn't really do a good job of executing. Uh, made a couple silly mistakes. They made a lot of great plays. They made us pay for it. And the weak side rebound to Carter. Carter the other way with a three in the air. That's nothing but net. He's got five straight Boilermaker points. And just like that, the lead's 13. let one slip away against Michigan that we felt we should have won. Uh, it was a very winnable game and uh, we just knew we couldn't go on to uh, going into conference play. It looked bad on us and uh, it, would, it would hurt our confidence. Got to make From this one. Smith is no good. He missed it. Rebound to Smotherman. Here comes Ronnie Johnson ahead to Stevens. Half court shot for the tie. No good and without timeouts Purdue was left without able to stop it and the Gophers hold on for a narrow three point win. It wasn't easy, but they got it. We showed for 35 minutes how good we can really be. Be extremely proud. Hold your head extremely high, okay, because that was a great win, and it's just the beginning. Great job. Bring it to the show. Great win. Good play. Family on three. One, two, three. Family. Good win, y'all. Down by one, the Nittany Lions, 24 on the shot clock, 45 on the game clock, and Matthew picked the pocket. Here comes DeAndre, and he will lay it in, and the Gophers lead by three. Matthew's come up big here late in the game, 15 for Matthew. My path to Minnesota um, started out Moorhead State as a walk-on. Um, didn't work out, didn't earn a scholarship, even though I played, I played in a lot of games in the season. Um, Got a call from Central Arizona, his first junior college I talked to when I said I was transferring. Um, like what they were talking about, wanted to get away towards the end of the season after the tournament, everything's over towards the end of the school year. Coach Kamani calls me and he's like, uh, we want to come see you. DeAndre, since the first time we, you know, we went to see him, we knew we'd be a perfect fit for the way we wanted to play. In reality, I looked at him as a, a mirror image of coach in a lot of ways. Um, a guy with a chip on his shoulder with a lot to prove um, that people doubt it. And I knew that if I can get those two on the same page, we'll have something special. Well, when we first got the job, we knew we had to go get a point guard. I've been able to coach a couple small point guards, uh, which is fine as long as they're fast and they got heart and they don't believe they're small. And DeAndre Matthew is one of those guys. He believes he's the biggest guy in the court. He believes he's the best point guard in the Big Ten. Um, and he's just made huge plays for us every single game in this Big Ten Conference. DeAndre Matthew, long three, good! Wow. Right side off a screen. He has seven, and Minnesota has a 19-point lead. What makes DeAndre a special player is uh, he's the fastest player in the country, knows how to get in the paint and find open teammates, and he can get in the lane and finish over the trees, which a lot of people can't do. Ray, for, he's, one thing that's very special and unique about him is that usually kids with his kind of speed get out of control. Um, and he plays at a great pace and he's always under control. So many people passed on me and even as I walked on at Moorhead, I, I felt like they didn't really give me the opportunity I felt I deserved. So to get an opportunity to play at the highest level is, 
it's really motivation and it really shows you that I did something good and I just gotta keep working. Nah, I never seen DeAndre. Nah, I'm just playing. Yeah, DeAndre has about a 40 inch vertical. He can throw up between his legs, uh, windmill, even 360. He's done some uh, some crazy dunks. I've seen him do it. I haven't seen him do it in a while, but, but the first time I went to see him, I guess he was showing off to say, hey, um, I'm good enough for Minnesota in the Big Ten. He, you know, he went baseline and, and windmill dunk. A crazy dunk story is actually on YouTube. We were in the regional to go to the national tournament and we're like, Five seconds left, I caught a fast break on the last play and I windmilled it. And the crowd just went crazy, like guys were running down on the floor and everything. And it was just really fun because that was the last play that took us into the national tournament. You know, he's the type of guy, he's kind of like a coach on the court. I can get on him and he never pouts, he responds. You go from being a walk-on to a junior college All-American to a starting point guard in the Big Ten, all in three years. Um, that says a lot about him and his character. I've been through a lot and I'm here. I made it to the Big Ten playing in Minnesota, so I mean, I have no choice but to be happy. Like, so many people from where I'm from, they don't get this opportunity. So, I mean, I'm happy that I'm here and my family's happy that I'm here. Everybody's really happy that I'm here, so I have no reason to be down. And, like, even when things are going down, I feel like as a point guard, it's my job to always stay up and to keep everybody else happy. And that's just what I try to do. Gopher men's basketball team is playing a Big Ten road game. Tonight, it's the Golden Gophers against the Nittany Lions of Penn State. Matthew gets a screen from King, lost his footing, but shoveled out to Hollins along the baseline to Oshnit, or I should say to Elias in reverse layup. Good and a three-point play. You know, our game plan was, you know, get it inside, you know, you know, challenge their bigs. We don't think they've been challenged very much. And then, you know, obviously working on transition game, try to get up down the court. We thought they struggle a little bit in the transition D. 14 to 3 the run here. Minnesota has gone from up 10 to down 1. Yeah, and the eight turnovers are very conducive to this Nittany Lion run. Not looking great, frankly, for the Maroon and Gold. Ball fake gets around Travis into the paint, leans in, layup good. Nice take by King, and it's 49-45. Gophers down by four. The Gophers have trailed by as many as eight here in the second half. They haven't played that well, but they're hanging around after starting the first 10 minutes really well. Balls were not really bouncing our way. They just were not um, going in our favor. And to be able to find a way to get a win on the road is huge. DeAndre Matthew gives Minnesota its first lead of the night of the second half, I should say, 60 to 59. John Johnson with it out front. Nine seconds. NBA range three left side to tie. Back iron no good. Rebound tip. Brandon Taylor has it with four seconds. Kick out. Long three. This is Roberts. Rims out no good. Back tap. There's the horn. And the Gophers have indeed stolen one. And Minnesota has come in here and gotten a win. Honestly, guys, we really did not play well. We made a lot of mistakes. A lot of mistakes. But good teams find a way to get it done when nothing is going right and you found a way to get a tough win on the road. It was not pretty, but we have to learn from that win. Good job, man. Good work, y'all. Good job, good job. One, two, three. Family. Family.